Of all the paths that lead to a woman's heart in Ireland, perhaps none is grander than a castle. Kaimura Abbey was originally built as a castle. The story starts with uh, Mitchell Henry, who was a wealthy Englishman, and he came in on honeymoon with his wife Margaret in the 1850s. And they both fell in love with the Connemara region, and Margaret was particularly drawn to this area called Kylemore, which in Gaelic means old wood. And years later, Mitchell Henry inherited a fortune from his father. So he came back to Kylemore and he bought 15,000 acres and he built this castle as a romantic gift for his wife Margaret. It's essentially their holiday home and they were based in London. And so over, the, over four years, they'd come here with um, family and friends and have big parties that would last for weeks or months. And um, they were very happy here. But the family went on holiday to Egypt and Margaret Henry contracted dysentery over there and she died within nine days. Um, Mitchell Henry was absolutely broken hearted and he had her body embalmed and brought back to Kylemore where she's laid to rest in a beautiful miniature cathedral that she built for her in her memory and that's on this site here. And Mitchell Henry was completely broken hearted for years later. He never, never remarried. Uh, he lost his daughter on this site as well. She was thrown from a horse and died tragically. So he was a very, very sad and broken hearted man. So Mitchell Henry died penniless and heartbroken in England. And he had his body brought back to Kylemore so he could be laid to rest beside his wife Margaret for all eternity.